there is a little bit of joy in uh, in doing that and the tinkering and just uh, you know and, and then of course the end result is finishing a project like that and sort of kind of the um, the pride that you take in completing something like that. So I can understand yeah, where yeah. this would be something where, you know, to bring, uh, you know, a, a kid in and say, Hey, you're going to build your own bike. You're going to work in the shop. You're going to build your own bike. And at the end it's yours. You know, there's a sen certain sense of pride yeah. there. I think yeah. that, you know, and, and confidence, right? I mean, I think that's something that. Oh, absolutely. I, yeah. Yeah. Well, we find it's interesting, like, the, I mean, kids just don't have an opportunity much these days to even work with hand tools. Like, it's not something you're doing in school really anymore. And so we find um, kids who may struggle in the traditional classroom or have behavior issues can come into the bike shop. And because it's so such kinesthetic learning, you're just using your whole body and uh, interacting with something real. Um, they can thrive and really enjoy it. Like, I think we were in the early days just surprised at how much kids enjoyed working with tools and working on bikes. Um, but it was neat to see. And um, you're absolutely right. When you learn a new skill, I mean, for, at any age, but especially in childhood and um, adolescence, um, it just does so much for your self-confidence. And sudden, like, suddenly those wheels start turning of like, hey, if I can do this, then what else can I do? Um, and those things really start to translate um, into other areas of life. Um, so that's so, so neat to see. It's something we're, we're super passionate about.